what if ai could invent new algorithms solve centuries old math problems and redesign the chips that power itself say hello to alpha evolve the google's deep minds revolutionary coding agent powered by gemini alpha evolve so here we are not talking about writing a python simple python program to add two numbers we are not talking about writing a python program for machine learning model we are talking about complex math problems guys and this this ai is game changing it's just not writing code it's evolving it from optimizing ai training to saving energy in massive data centers this ai is already reshaping the future of computing and you know what the craziest part it even helped train the very model it's built on so basically it self improving kind of this ain't a science fiction it's alpha evolve let's dive in this is the white paper that deepmind released they're calling alpha evolve as a coding agent for scientific and algorithmic discovery so let's look at what they say in the introduction here. So discovering new knowledge, high value knowledge, such as making novel scientific discovery or developing a commercial valuable algorithm requires a prolonged process of ideation, exploration, black backtracking, blah, blah, blah. So these, so they say that LLMs can be used for certain things which are good, uh, like code generation, but they are not really there when it comes to generating something completely new like new algorithms or new scientific discovery so in this paper they present llm code super optimization agent called alpha evolve this takes on this challenge using combination of evolutionary computation and llm based code generation i still don't understand what evolutionary means here uh, so let's look at it uh, yeah i think they have described it here the evolutionary process in Alpha Evolve leverages modern LLM's ability to respond to feedback, enabling the discovery of candidates that are substantially different from the initial candidate pool in syntax and functions. So basically, they are saying that they are producing something new, right? It is applicable both to problems where discovering new algorithms is the intrinsic goal, as well as the broad range of problems where the solution of interest is not an algorithm itself, but an algorithm can describe how that solution is to be constructed or found. So discovering the algorithm is not only an instrumental goal, but it turns out to be a surprisingly effective strategy compared to searching for the solutions directly. So basically they are evolving uh, the algorithm that kind of learns from itself in a way and tries to find out what is the best solution kind of. Uh, so I, I have heard about this search, uh, fun search. They, they, they used to be quite good actually, but not that, uh, they didn't get that much traction because they were quite early in the game. Uh, so fun search, which uses LLM guided solution to discover heuristic in order to construct novel mathematical objects. So they are here, they have given the difference between fun search and alpha wall. So you can see that fun search is quite basic, but it came quite early as well. So the novelty is coming from them, to be honest. So evolve single function, evolve entire code file, evolve up to 10 to 20 lines of code, evolves up to hundreds of lines of code. They can evolve any language, but fun search is only in Python. And needs faster evaluation, can evaluate for hours in parallel or, accel or accelerators. Uh, optimize single metric can optimize multiple metrics trying to improve on metrics multiplication algorithms alpha evolved improves stress in algorithm by discovering algorithm using 48 multiplications so stress in algorithm was the first algorithm or the first matrix multiplication algorithm that actually improved the matrix multiplication from o and cube to less than that and it uses the divide and conquer approach. And I think alpha evolve is kind of using the similar kind of approach. And you know, matrix multiplication is one of the most critical piece. Because if you look at all your neural networks, all your CPUs or GPUs computations, everything involves matrix multiplications. And if you are able to achieve that faster, I think you will be able to solve some of the complex problems Alpha Evolve architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point. So they have a base algorithm, a prompt template and evaluation methods. 
The system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. And then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results. These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolving algorithms for complex mathematical and computational challenges. So you can see uh, the user provided file with blocks marked for evolution and the special evaluate function that can be invoked to score the current version of the code. So this is the assemble input to the LLM. Act as an export software developer. Your task is to iteratively improve the provided code base. And here you see that you kind of provided it all the info instructions here is the current program we are trying to improve make sure that these changes you propose are consistent with each other for example if you refer to a new config variable somewhere l5ball architecture operates as a closed loop system where variable. scientists provide a starting Instead point of providing that they have a the base algorithm to the a prompt LLM. template and, and then evaluation here this methods. is the output of the LLM. the system iteratively the evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate in blocks we can improve its performance by increasing and then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test so the kind of it kind of proposes these variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify evaluator to evaluate over time this process converges on the most the efficient and, and innovative and solution return, effectively uh, evolving algorithms for solution. complex mathematical and computational challenges so it follows a dual model strategy it uses gemini 2.0 flash and gemini 2.0 pro uh, for optimizing algorithmic discovery flash generates a very f high volume of fast low latency ideas while pro, pro is known for high quality suggestions uh, by diving deeper into uh, in these ideas this ensemble balances speed and insights following alpha evolved to explore a wide solution space efficiently still capturing the transformative breakthroughs so all the solutions proposed by rlm are evaluated for that they use three different techniques evaluation cascade so here in this the user provides a set of test cases and only only alpha evolve architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point to the next stage so they have a base algorithm a prompt template and evaluation with the test cases those intrinsic the system iteratively evolves the these LLM algorithms using a prompt uh, sampler to generate to inputs get the LLM generated feedback and then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results the these variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements over time, this process converges so, on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolution evolving algorithms for evolved, complex mathematical and growing number of computational challenges. With evaluation results. These solutions are stored in an evolutionary database, the primary goal of which is to optimally resurface previous explored ideas in future generations. This is important because it's not just discarding those ideas, right? It's keeping them in the database. Key challenge in designing such database is ex balancing exploration and exploitation to cons continuously improve the best program. In Alpha Evolve, the evolutionary database implements an algorithm that is inspired by a combination of map elite algorithms and island based population models. So, I'm not too familiar with those and probably we won't look at them for now. But uh, seems like this is the evolutionary database implementation it uses. Alpha Evolve is implemented as an async computational pipeline in which many computations are run current currently with each computation blocking whenever its next step relies on the result of another. So typical uh, parallel processing here. Alpha Evolve Alpha achieved a breakthrough by discovering a new algorithms system where scientists provide a starting point. Complex matrices, they have a base algorithm, a prompt template, and evaluation methods. Wow, so seems like this is the system a iteratively here. evolves these uh, algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. Uh, did in and then a large language model ensembled to create code variations and an evaluator pool. It also tackled over 50 open These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify solutions in 75%. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution.
No effectively it evolving a 300 year old kissing problem by discovering a configuration of 593 spe- spheres in 11 dimensions, setting a new lower bound. These results showcase alpha ev- evolves power in both al- algorithmic optimizations and fundamental mathematics. Google also released the Google Colab notebook. Alpha Evolve architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point. So they have a base algorithm, a prompt template, and evaluation methods. The system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. And then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results. These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolving algorithms for complex mathematical and computational challenges. This is for the decomposition of 245 over 0.5z. Look at this this code here, 2 million cells. So this is the data. So when we, so if you see look, look at the code here so this one alpha evolve architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point so they have a base algorithm a prompt template and evaluation methods the system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs and then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results these variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolving algorithms for complex mathematical and computational challenges. Verified tensor decomposition, decomposition 245 is the matrix that we just looked at. Rank is 32. Let's run this. Verified the decomposition of rank rank 32 for matrix tensor 245. This decomposition uses three factors. So I'm looking for 247. We run this here. The verif- verified decomposition of rank 45 for matrix tensor. See how fast it is. The decomposition uses these these factors. Uh, Alpha Evol architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point. So they have a base algorithm, a prompt template, and evaluation methods. The system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. And then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results. These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolving algorithms for complex mathematical and computational challenges. They give the solutions to these problems as well. Some of differences of the finite set, I want to look at the... Minimizing the ratio of maximum of minimum distance. So these are all complex mathematical problems that have been there for quite some time with not much progress. Kissing number. This is what I was looking for. The kissing problem asks how many spheres can be arranged tangent to a given sphere if all of the same size and the d- and their interiors do not overlap. For d is equal to 11, the best known lower bound was 592. And alpha evolved improved it with 593. That's crazy. So let's look at the data here, show code, sphere center. So these are the seven spheres, I think, that we are talking with. These are the spheres that we are talking about. In this case, it will be probably 500 something. So just run this first. Alpha Evolve architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point. So they have a base algorithm, a prompt template and evaluation methods. The system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. And then a large language model ensemble to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results. These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolving algorithms for complex mathematical and computational this challenges. This is better than 592 proposed in earlier. So yeah, this is again a 
significant improvement over the existing solutions so not much is given in terms of the code but i think it's just they are trying to show that they actually got improved on these numbers and they have given the verification how they actually did it L5 wall architecture so operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point. So they have a base algorithm, a prompt template, and evaluation methods. The system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. And then a large language model ensembled to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test the results. These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient and innovative solution, effectively evolving algorithms for complex mathematical and computational challenges. But one thing is that many of these ma complex mathematical problems are kind of solved by alpha. alpha code. So it, this definitely sounds very intriguing. I am very excited. I applied for a full access here. Um, so I will be sharing with you guys how it is uh, my feedback of the model I'm gonna be trying it out on different different algorithms yeah that's it from my side hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you have a good understanding now of, of how alpha 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 evolve works, architecture operates as a closed loop system where scientists provide a starting point so they have a base algorithm, a prompt template, and evaluation uh, methods. The system iteratively evolves these algorithms using a prompt sampler to generate inputs. And then a large language model ensembled to create code variations and an evaluator pool to test results. These variations are stored in a program database and compared to identify improvements. Over time, this process converges on the most efficient.